Hi everyone, this is Dr. Karim Galil. I'm the co-founder and CEO of Mendel AI. Mendel is a machine that understands medicine. We developed novel artificial intelligence technology that reads uh, clinical language in literature, patients' medical records, and is able to absorb all the written clinical knowledge. Today, uh, we are launching a search engine that leverages our AI technology to analyze more than 50,000 publications uh, around coronaviruses and COVID-19. This will enable researchers to quickly answer questions like, what do we know about the transmission of SARS-CoV-2? What are the risk factors for COVID-19? What kind of treatments can we repurpose? Um, I would like to show you a demo of how this works. The website is publicly available at covid19.mendel.ai. Once you log in there, there is a search bar, and before you're using it, you have to understand that this is a, uh, a very sophisticated search engine that is not doing a keyword match or matching a word and all its synonyms. It actually understands context. So if we search for something like COVID, Nineteen and symptoms. It will surface around five, more than five thousand publications, and in each publication, it will highlight for you uh, where there are any mention of symptoms. It can relate that cough is a symptom. It can relate that dyspepsia is a symptom. Severe pneumonia in children is a symptom, um, and it basically can understand also that. Uh, 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 you as a human being want to validate the results of the AI. So you can always open the full text and you can see all the highlights that basically why the AI uh, recommended this paper. Now, one of our researchers did this very interesting search when we were beta testing the product and they did COVID-19 and treatment and in more than 3,000 publications, the AI highlighted several potential treatments like antibiotics, uh, HIV protease inhibitors, uh, uh, rapamycin. But very interestingly, and I'm going to quickly jump here, they found that there is a mention of a calcium channel blocker, diltiazem. It's a drug used for hypertension. And it was very interesting, why is diltiazem mentioned in a coronavirus paper? So what you can do at that time is you can clear the search you can start a new one where you want to see all papers that have a mention of COVID-19 and any mention of diltiazem. There are actually nine publications and if you go through them, you're going to figure out that there are actually evidence, preclinical evidence and clinical evidence that diltiazem can stop the viral replication. It's not only uh, a treatment, it's also even a preventive drug. And one of those very interesting papers for me, some of them were dated back to 2007, but a very interesting one, highly recommend to read, this one published in 2019. And what I do is I can always open the paper, let me actually open the full text for the paper, and again, I can use Command F to just jump straight, since it's a really long read, just, just jump straight to where I want to read, which is the diltiazem and see what kind of combination and what kind of clinical trial actually that had any evidence around that. Um, this is pretty interesting. As you can see quickly, we're able to figure out knowledge uh, or extract knowledge that we as human beings will be prone to miss given the big volume of the data that we have, sift, uh, that we have to sift through. Um, please go try covid19.mendel.ai. Feel free to ping us if you have any questions. My email is karim, K-A-R-I-M, at mendel.ai, and we're more than happy to support. And if you find any, anything interesting through the product, please feel, uh, please feel free to share it with us. Thank you.